flashback to the time I almost passed out. Um, so we, I was at the podiatrist and um, they scraped some of my planner and wore it off. Um, right after we left to check out, um, I, start feel, I started feeling nauseous. I felt like I was about to puke. I went blind and I also had a headache and a stomach ache. I could only sit down. I couldn't fall asleep. I felt so dizzy. I felt like I was about to puke too. And I had to go sit down and it was like really scary because once I got, um, once I felt better, I was literally yellow and we got, and we got McDonald's, but I don't think that helped me because my mom was talking on the on her phone um about you know about my trip to the doctor because people were worried and said that they scraped my foot which made me feel really uncomfortable i didn't want to talk about it to anybody and uh now every single time we put um a bandage on it it doesn't stay there so once we literally had to put a cast on it um, that, and that was the time I almost passed out. Oh yeah, once we got home, it was also kind of scary for that. Only because, um, mm -hmm. I need to say it. It was really scary because, you know, that wasn't my first time though. I did it once when I was two, and once at another time when I was like younger than that. Um, that was creepy, but it was, um, but it was in 2022, so, I mean, it still scares me because, uh, the day before, um, the day that, the other day that I had it when I was a little bit younger, just a little bit, not, not two, but, like, a little bit older than that, and it was, like, Um, so I was late because, you know, I almost passed out. I wasn't yellow that time, though. I did, I, I kind of went blind, though. I kept seeing patterns, patterns, because, uh, if you didn't know, I have really bad burnt retina, so it's kind of, it was kind of a struggle, because, like, everything was black, I felt nauseous, just like, just like the trip to the hospital, the hospital, and, um, so... Then I um and the and a little bit before I oh I need to finish telling the school story. Um, the teacher just said to get to class when I was literally about to pass out. My sugar was low, so we didn't really have anything to worry about. But still, why tell me to get to class when I was literally about to pass out? Oh, there's me raging. <laughs> that was funny. Yeah. I was so young at the time, but I had to put this video clip in because it's the only one I have of me playing an obby. <laughs> I left the game. I was so mad. I was so mad. Why am I playing the same game? Why don't I just join Cotton Obby or something? Um, For now, I'm just going to be reacting to my other video from like a long time ago when I was... I don't even want to say what age. I was really young at the time. Um, it's not even from recently. Um, so yeah, we might just have a minute of a bunch of stickers popping in, um, which will be the outro. So yeah, um, you get to hear younger me rage. At this point, I was calm and I felt really confident, so um, I didn't rage this time, I don't think.
Oh, there it is, a rage. Yeah, I love to see my younger self rage. It's so pretty. But also, those yellow braids, though. <laughs> also, that face cam is me from when I was younger, obviously. Um, and I doesn't have the same glasses. Which, that's how you can tell. Because I once I broke one pair of glasses, and the other one was also broken. But, uh, I luckily, I grew out of those prescriptions. Now I'm in this one. I'm not going to say my prescription. Uh, it's kind of some info that I can't, I don't want to share on this platform. More of my private stuff, maybe. Not, not private, but I was on 6%. Why would I record and like, oh, okay, bye.